Now you can also use these Nanoleaf essential light bulbs as a wick light, but you have to be a little bit creative. The first solution is to download this wake up light application and it is really simple. You just connect to your HomeKit environment. You select which accessory you like to connect, but you can only use one light. So in my case, I have three light bulbs in my lamp and I can only use one of those light bulbs. So it is plug and play really easy, but it would be nicer to have all three light bulbs activated. But this application shows me how it works a little bit. So here you can choose the time that uh, you need. So I really like to start the light going on 30 minutes before I have to get out of my bed. Here you can see how it goes from really dark to bright. And you can also see the colors that it uses. Now, when we go to the HomeKit application into our scenes, you can see that it added a lot of extra scenes. And in these scenes, you can see that the spotlights are on. And now here I can choose to add my other lights as well and set them to the same, same percentage. So temperature is all to the left. And I set this one as well. Now this should be more or less the same. Now I've added the other two spots to all the scenes. And when you go back to the application itself, you can see that my other spots became visible as well. But it also says that I'm not in the normal settings. You can see restore it or you have to pay. But Nevertheless, therefore I found another solution. This really helped me to find the right scenes, the right colors. Now I went to my shortcut application and in the shortcut application I create a similar thing. So let's look into it and here you can see scene one, wait for three minutes, then scene two, etc, etc. And after half an hour, it is at 100%. And it also activates another scene. And this scene is, as you can see here, the LED strip and the home pods where it plays the radio. Now, to activate this, let's go back. I set it up here. So automation immediately, immediately after confirmation or don't activate. So right now it is turned off, but if I want to use, let's say tomorrow I have to stand up at 6.30, this runs for half an hour. So I have to set this to execute immediately and execute at six o'clock. There you go. So right now my alarm will be set at six o'clock. The lights will turn on gradually and at 6.30 they will be at 100% and the radio starts playing.
So of course it is a little bit different than setting up a normal automation where you can simply toggle on or off your automation, but still it is feasible. And this way you can use your Nanoleaf Essential Bill as a wake up light. So I hope you like this little tutorial. Don't forget to leave a comment, share, like and subscribe and I'll see you in the very next video. Bye bye.